Dornish wished to have a war with us. Yesterday I was informed that there was a dead Dornishman on our doorstep, and there was a woman, a Dornish woman, who was acting very suspicious. It is my personal belief that he was killed in our land to start a war. We must stay out of Dornish territory. You must all prepare yourselves with armour. You may not be soldiers, but you must be outfitted. And you can wear journeyman armour. The other thing is, it will be all hands on deck. We need ballistas, we need ammo for those ballistas, we need trebuchets, we need swords and other weapons. This you must do while keeping quiet and inside of the veil. I am begging you all to stay within the Vale lands and the north. Do not go further south. Lady, may I speak? Plan to try and keep us safe. Whenever you're, whenever you allow me to, I'll speak, my lady. My apologies. No, it's fine. Very well. Stable hands, so there's morphodons that we have inside the stable. The, the ones that aren't breeders, <laughs> set them up on top of the wall. Or low, you can show them where on the wall. They fly down. Set them up on our side of the wall. Alright, have some on ours, my apologies. Some on our side, some on their side. When I say on our side, I mean on the ledges or near the ledges, so that if we call them and have to whistle them to attack, they can fly down and attack our enemies. Stable hands will have a part in this. Any other um, animals that we could see or use as defensive animals aside from our morphodon, so we can use them as well, alpha raptors, etc. Or though you have a way with words, if we could, uh, we'll speak afterwards about getting more defenses from a different kingdom. Cook, Chef Arion, if you can make us some of that, uh, some of that food that maybe makes us a bit stronger, and ensure that everybody has at least a plate on them at all times, just in case they need to defend themselves. We also need some health potions where we have to get in touch with the maester. When you, when you are a citizen of the Vale, or a citizen of any kingdom, there are times that we'll be required to bear arms and defend ourselves and defend our home. It seems like it may be one of those times. We are not the instigators or antagonists in this dispute that we're having. We're the defenders. We're the fucking Vale. We don't play this shit. We don't stand for dead bodies at our doorstep. Doesn't matter if it was from Dornish lands or any other lands. We protect our own here. We're a goddamn family. This is how we've been. Since day one. This is how we'll remain. Even if we die together. So, that's not the intention. We have our knights, we have our squires, we have our leadership. Everybody here plays an equal part. This isn't just a knight ordeal. This is an everybody ordeal. This is the goddamn veil. And this is how we're going to do it. Lady Aaron is more than adequate in these situations. I've seen her grow and develop into the leader that she is, and she knows exactly what to do, as well as myself and Sir Renal. I want everybody to know that they're going to have a part in this victory that the Vale will have if we do come under siege or attack. We have strong allies. Our numbers may not be strong alone, but together with the friends and resources that we have, I don't believe any kingdom out there can really stand a chance against us. Ensure to yourself that this is a victory going into it, and the victory is what we'll have. Again, we're going to need medical brews, foods, beer as well. A lot of people don't know this, but I'm going to throw this out there for you. When you drink a beer, you have two minutes that you will fight stronger than you've ever fought. Well, but you can't drink, so never mind that. We're not drinking beer. <laughs> My apologies, I was just... Recall something, forget you, about the beer. You just want all that beer, we know it. Yeah, I do. That's fine. In so other I words, like to say. Indeed. there is enough demorphodons in the barn. Every member is to have a demorphodon. Train your demorphodon to have a strong bite and to be very healthy. Keep it so that, well, teach it, that if anybody attacks you, it is to instantly attack them. A morphodon may possibly save your life. I do not wish to see anybody with an empty shoulder. Lilith, you have a sister, don't you? Yeah, she's currently sleeping. How old is she? 
14. You fight for her. We all fight for her. If the veil comes under attack. Elsa Avrilla just came to us. How old is she? Lady Aaron, 10? No, didn't ask. And yes, yeah, old. We fight for her when the veil comes under attack. Remember this. These are the people that we fight for. And this is the motivation that we have within us. What did you call us? Moon Guard, Lady Aaron? <laughs> yes. As defenders of the veil and the Moon Guard. To ensure that these children grow up in a place that's not held down under Dornish laws or any other laws for that matter. And this is what we stand for. For those children that we have out there sleeping right now. And if we could keep this, perhaps not in their direct light of uh, acknowledgement, would that be okay, Lady Aaron? And they do know something's going on and I want them to be aware, but I also don't want them to know the, the exact uh, magnitude of it. It is alright for them be to be slightly ignorant, but they must know what is going on. They must know well. why we are telling them to stay out of Dornish land. Even though they are children, they must know these things to keep themselves safe. I will not keep it from them. Understood. I understand also this does not put a cease on any operations. They still mine, if Lady Aaron permits so, but we will wear our fucking armor at all times. And that means that we will not be shirtless. We will not be pantsless, we will not be gloveless. We will wear every piece of armor that we have, regardless of the situation. Because if someone is that ballsy to leave a dead body at our doorstep, uh, they'd have no problem hitting anybody down there mining metal or uh, taming a steed or whatever else anybody decides to do, picking berries. So just maintain yourself at high alert. Always have your gear on, on you and be ready and able to fight at a moment's notice. If you do see something suspicious, this is your safe place. You come here. You come to the Vale. Nowhere else. Come to the veil. Speak with myself and Lady Aaron. And that's all I have to say. Training. If you wish to learn how to use a sword, I'll be having a training session tonight. Every citizen of the veil is invited and encouraged to come. If you are better with a bow, then by all means shoot your bow. But you must learn to use a sword in hand to hand combat also. I know you are not combatants. I know you are strong. I only wish to keep you alive. As such, I ask you to be careful. Please respect the rules I've just put down. These are not to curtail what you are doing, but to keep you alive. We do not know if we are at war yet, but it sounds as though we may be. There is nothing that I can do to stop it. Alright. For you. Put your shield away, fool. This is a winning. Grand Maester, I bring before you Lady Erin. Of the veil. Be wed. Reynald Mormont. You're good. Screw Java, please. Oh. oh. The mysters are not men of the gods. But there is mysteries in this world. Greatest of them is love. You, Lady Kieran Aaron, in there. You expect Sir Mormon to be the husband of him. Do you, Sir Mormon, now protect? Of, 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 
<laughs> I do. Have you rings? Or any other? Please take each other's hand. Are these with old gods? Light of beat and love. Announce humanity. Love you cherish each other. It's your bride <laughs> Before the lords and ladies and kings and queens, once you wed your bride. Leave a month to bear with the curtains. If I had my youth, I believe I say, let's eat. Yeah. See what I start. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not familiar with your. The words are bloody party. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. If you would like to get your butts off these sore, hard seats and move over to the feasting area. Congratulations, my lady, my lord. Congratulations. Congratulations. Welcome to the family. Of course. Of course. After all, the chairs are more comfortable, aren't they, my dear? Especially for your fat ass. He told hey, who you said that? Cedric. Who said that? The last thing you'll do, my friend. Last thing you'll do. <laughs> you? Hold on, I'll sit next to him. Okay. I always have trouble with these fucking chairs, don't I? Hey, yep. Okay. All right. Again? No, no, no. I just sit. Uh, don't worry about me. He's just traumatized by the chairs. He has trouble oh, getting in and out of him. Cedric, where's Kinsley? Wait, she over here. She's still yeah. feeling ill. Ah, what's happening with the child? Hi, he is well. Oh, I don't know how it goes. 
Okay, Alan. I just have seen things now. Mm -hmm. I, I can't. So what now? If you want. I was Bear Allen, I've seen a few new faces. Uh, yeah, just a few. Since <laughs> you left, uh, everybody's new. We need a lot of plays for that. Digging the same plate, can't we? <laughs> I'm gonna lay off my potatoes. That's mine. I'm gonna have just the same hey, thing. Those are my potatoes. You fucked right off, sir. <laughs> you got plenty of potatoes back at home. <laughs> Damn right. <laughs> gonna make sure Lady Aaron's not coming over there and stealing my potatoes. for you, potato for me, and eh, fuck that one, he doesn't deserve anything, apple for her. Where's the carrot? Apples. <laughs> Grand Maester, it's good to see you in the north, or at least close to the north. I appreciate your efforts put forward to marrying little lady Erin. Very kind of you. Do my best, Joker. It appears as though our own master has not woken up in quite a while. Concerned for his health. It appears to be an illness that spreads through their masters. I'll tell you, as soon as they get those damn chains, their head just can't leave the pillow. In infinite grace, they are fucking pillows. <laughs> so, <laughs> the wedding is a lot smaller than it was planned to be. It was planned to be a public nice. wedding, however, okay, due to recent events of people. Pass, what are you saying? And, like threats and things happening. And like, very uh, so odd. I said I was stepping cake in my face. Possible war things happening. It was a side just to make it a northern it's affair. Thank you, Lady Arrow. What do you think this time we're more want? Cake poisoning or not? It's just definitely one of the two. I haven't tried the kick yet. I see. Aaron? Let's get to it. <clears throat> yes, sir. Uh, fine. Hello, what do, what do we have to eat? Yeah, uh, like. Arian, could you make sure that Queen Stark has the soft drink, please? Okay. Appreciate that, my lady. Indeed. Indeed, since it's maturity. I know it is not customary. I wish for the Rhino to now be Lord. So, 
instead of sitting here in complete silence, which I'm sure is completely riveting for all of you, who would like to tell a joke? Uh. Sing a song. Give us some joy. You should sing the song, Lady Aaron. You have a pretty good voice. Singing voice. But right now, I don't. You'll, you'll have to I, excuse I think my silence. I'm I'm four bottles deep. Why don't you tell us a joke then? Bottles. That's all you've ever been deep in. <laughs> Mind your tongue, Marcus. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather be that than uh, than a prison, Sir Buckwell. And shots are fired. <laughs> Do you need a maester for that burn? <laughs> I need one. <laughs> Right, seriously, bring us some jokes. Come on. All right, I will be the first. Uh, Since no one is deciding to be entertaining, I shall be entertaining at my own wedding. Hopefully, <laughs> I'm hoping this kind of works. <clears throat> I will sing a song. It's one I have recently learnt. It's kind of a shame that we couldn't it's have everyone at the exactly wedding. Not exactly a happy song, but it's quite interesting if you listen. But. To <clears throat> Quite a decent amount of people showed up, even though it was just northern people. Like, why not a happy song? Can't, can't we have a happy song at your wedding? Um, I don't I, I would like a happy song. This should, I mean, all right. I think I after this, I'm gonna, I'm gonna prep the table. Tune, okay? I want to redo this area, or at least, or at least I want to re. I want to just prep the tables for plates. And then keep them prepped as well, so I'm not having to do it like just before the wedding. And they were as black as they might be. With a down. Then one of them said to his mate, Where shall we our breakfast take? With a down, derry, 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 down, down. Down in yonder hallowed field. Down a down, hey down a down. There lies a knight slain under a shield. With a down, his hounds they do lie at his feet. So well do their masters keep. With a down, derry 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 down down. His hawks they fly so eagerly. Down a down, hey down a down. No other fowls dare him come nigh. With a down, yonder comes a fellow doe. With a great chunk she might go. With a down, derry, 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 down, down. Oh, she lifts up his bloody head. You need a tissue. Down, down, hey, down, a down. And kiss his wounds that are so red. With a down, she lifts him onto her back and carries him to earth and lay. With a down, derry, 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 down, down. She buried him before his prime. Down, a down, hey, down, a down. She was dead herself, evening song time. With a down, God send you all, you gentlemen, such and such hooks. Oh, God. Oh, well, I'm done. <laughs> that was very good. <laughs> well done, my, my lady. Well done. Good job, Lord, Lady Aaron. Oh, yeah, that was great. Right. Right, so uh, I've got I've got a joke here. A joke. Bring me some wine, real quick, please. So every wedding needs a bedding. Are you ready for it? What? <clears throat> Pardon? Can I 
Uh, Say it all for you! <laughs> A betting <laughs> ceremony! Go on, cousin. Make a woman out of her. <laughs> Join me, my friends. Bedding, 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 bedding. The people demand a bedding. Come, you. Lord Momont, grab the boy. I've got the girl. Let's get this bedding Let's go right on. <laughs> Where's the bedroom? Let's go, come on you. It's Get upstairs going. last time I heard. Let's go, girl. By the gods. Oh, that is scary, Let's Dad. Oh, look. Fuck the door shut. Oh. Right, the open the damn door. <laughs> open the door, oh. right Unlock. That is scary. Open the door, let's go. Chop, chop. Hey, Kaz, jump up there. Bedding, bedding. <laughs> Until you see the sea and it looks in the north. Come on, Brenda. Yes, you can see better. I've heard that it's the Nope, don't open that door again. Go. Oh, my God. I'm going to drag you in the bedroom. Of course not. I would not do that. Careful. I'm down here. Down here. If you fall down there, you don't get injured. It's over. If you fall down there, here so it's your chest. Step it off. Okay. Guys, you should probably step ready. back. You're tempting me way, way too much. <laughs> <laughs> She's real, man. Bye. In the bed, you two. Nope, oh, in there. The the door. I really want to What? In the bed. Get in there. He dared me to get on the fence, and I did. Congratulations you know, you on your bed. You fall. Now God get naked and do it. it. Look, please. The Lord and Lady Aaron. Oh, okay. the Lord and the Lady! Can you hear the king That's screaming up in the rooms? Word. For the Lord and the Lady! <laughs> You're gonna have to. This castle better be out. bumping tonight! Come on. You don't let them leave their room for the next five hours, you understand me? <laughs> yes, sir. But bar the doors, bring them food and wine, they'll <laughs> need it. <with> the bunching. <laughs> not too much wine, or he may not last. This is different. It's time for me to bed oh. my own queen. Oh. Brenda. I'm the bravest of them all! No, you don't have any What chance. are you doing, Cass? What are we doing? No, what Cass is doing? What are you doing? <laughs> I heard me to get on the fence! Well, you fall, you're dead! <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's a There's no returning from that okay. down there. I'm just gonna sit here. Oh. Be a fool. <laughs> probably have it covered right now. Alright, we'll let's make, go. Um, we'll make the top All right. and put it on it. Caleb, have fun. Make sure they get it on. Oh, everybody's leaving, huh? Yeah, this is great. <laughs> fuck now and make the child of the green. Yeah. Damn right. Kiss me, you guys. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. I just bought some bottles, my king. I... I drank my share, what about you? Oh, Do we no. need the rope oh, for the saddle? Actually, John, here. Here, take these. Where is my bet? Where is my bet? Oi! I can't get on Did my bed. Did you even bet. bring a bear? I... This is my bear, my king. Hurry up, not the key. Thank you, Aaron. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sir Aaron, Aaron. Sir Aaron, Aaron of Aaron. Oh, sorry. The queen of the <laughs> air. I found my wolf finally. Aaron, I got a joke for you. Let's go home. Well, it's it's a uh, help of you. Let me. Uh, okay. Oh god, the headaches are bad. She didn't drink enough uh, if you, she's got headaches. Okay. Uh, what Queen, you want to do something daring? Uh, uh, I dare you to take the bear off the cliff with me. 
Not a good idea. Let's follow the down the street. Oh, oh, I like that one. Are you sure? I'm only bad can't to bear to do it. Is that everyone? What is that? Off duty, put yourselves, uh, take rest of that off, whatever you want to do, take care of it, but remember, we're still at a high threat level, so no leaving the north of the veil for the time being. No. Hmm. Join me in the step. Keep your shit about you. Punish yourselves. None of the beasts inside work. 